Step into the realm of prompt engineering, a skill at the forefront of the AI renaissance, where words shape the future. In an era where an estimated 75% of businesses are expected to use AI by 2025, mastering the art of prompt crafting is not just an advantage, it's a necessity. This tutorial is your gateway to becoming an adept prompt engineer, enhancing AI's effectiveness by as much as 50%. Our journey will uncover the secrets behind formulating prompts that unlock AI's most sophisticated and insightful responses. Designed for both tech enthusiasts and professionals, this guide demystifies the complexities of AI interactions. You will learn to craft prompts that are not just questions, but keys to unlocking AI's vast potential in creativity, analysis, and innovation. And before we move on, just a quick info for you. If you are one of the aspiring prompt engineer enthusiast or AI and ML enthusiast looking for online training and graduating from the best universities or a professional who elicits to switch careers in prompt engineering by learning from the experts, then try giving a shot to Simply Learn's postgraduate program in AI and ML engineering in collaboration with Purdue University and IBM. By enrolling in this certification program, you will gain expertise in skills like generative AI, prompt engineering, chat GPT, explainable AI, machine learning algorithms, supervised and unsupervised learning, model training and optimization, and there's much more on the list. With hands-on experience in tools like ChatGPT, DALE, Python, OpenCV and TensorFlow, you will catch the eye of the top recruiters. So what are you waiting for? Hurry up and enroll now. A year of experience is preferred to enroll in these courses. You can find the course link in the description box and pinned comment. So let's get started without any further ado. So first we'll see what is prompt engineering. So let's demystify what prompt engineering actually is. In the simplest terms, it's the art and science of crafting inputs or prompts to effectively communicate with AI models like GPT-3, DALE and others. It's about being precise, creative and strategic to elicit the best possible responses. But why does it matter? Well, with the right prompt, you can unlock the full potential of AI from generating artistic masterpieces to solving complex problems. Let's break it down into the basics. A good prompt should be clear, concise and directed. And you should avoid ambiguity and be as descriptive as necessary. Remember, you are guiding the AI to understand exactly what you want. Here's where the magic of prompt engineering really comes into play. By tweaking just a few words, you can dramatically change the output. As you delve deeper into various instances and uses of prompt engineering, it becomes evident that a prompt is composed of several key components. And now, we'll see those components. A prompt may include any combination of the following components. That is, instruction, a precise action or directive you wish the model to execute. And then comes context, that is, background information or supplementary context that can guide the model towards more accurate responses. And then we have input data, the specific inquiry or data for which you seek a response. And then comes output indicator, the desired structure or nature of the response. Not all four components are necessary for every prompt and their utilization varies based on the specific task. We will explore more detailed examples in the future tutorials. So are you ready to level up your prompt engineering skills? Here are some pro tips. Use specific and detailed language, experiment with different phrasings and consider the model's limitations. And don't forget to iterate. The best prompt engineers constantly refine their prompts based on the AI's responses. Alright, it's time to put theory into practice. I will walk you through a live demonstration of crafting prompts for different scenarios. Watch closely as I adjust the wording and structure to achieve the desired outcomes. Feel free to follow along with your own AI tool. So here we'll use the chat GPT and that is the GPT-4 version. And before starting, I want to tell you that even experts make mistakes. Here are some common pitfalls to avoid in prompt engineering. Overcomplicating your prompt, being too vague or misunderstanding the AI's capabilities can lead to unexpected and sometimes hilarious results. Learn from these missteps to perfect your technique. So now we'll start with the demo and first we'll open our chat GPT. So let's start with the first prompt and we name it as text condensation and refinement. So in this text condensation is a critical skill that is used in natural language processing and serving as a broad spectrum of domains. Among the most exciting applications for language models is their ability to distill complex models and complex articles and concepts into brief. 
easy to understand summaries. Let's dive into an enhanced text condensation exercise using prompts. Suppose you are curious about the role of antioxidants in the body. You might craft a prompt like this that I will write. Summarize the role of antioxidants. So now let's see what our chat GPT gives us the output. So you can see that the chat GPT has completed its response and like to refine this information further, you might instruct the chat GPT or your model to encapsulate the essence in a shorter format. So for that, you can write a prompt that use the above context and summarize this into some 100 words or some 200 words or just condense this into a brief explanation. So we will do that. So now you can see that the chat GPT has taken our query or the prompt and it has condensed the above content into a brief explanation. So accordingly you could use different prompts. And now we'll move to DALE and we'll generate a image and here we'll like we'll use the condensed format only to give a prompt to DALE. So we'll write generate a highly detailed image of a futuristic city uh, and we can specify what time of day we want that at dusk and featuring towering skyscrapers with glowing windows or flying cars and a sky filled with neon colored clouds so we can give the prompt or generate prompt like that only so we will write the prompt for that that is detailed image of a futuristic city and here we'll specify the time for the day uh, that would be at dusk and featuring towering skyscrapers with glowing windows flying cars and what you need to specify you could do that So let's see what DALE respond to us and you could see that it's repeat and you could see that DALE is creating image now with the prompt we entered and this is the response. So it has given us that here are the images of the futuristic city at dusk featuring towering skyscrapers with glowing windows, flying cars and a sky filled with neon colored clouds. You could see the picture here. So similarly, you can give prompts to DALE or any other AI tool and you can get the output as expected and you can iterate your prompts according to the AI's capabilities. And now moving back to chat GPT. So here we will come to another type of prompt that is information synthesis and retrieval. So these language models excel not only in language generation but also in extracting and synthesizing information from text. So we will consider this prompt that is designed to pull specific details from a given narrative. So we will ask it that researchers often use various AI tools including LLMs like OpenAI's GPT in their studies. So I have a prompt written. We will use that and let's see what chat GPT gives the response for this prompt. So you could see here that researchers often use various AI tools including LLMs like OpenAI's GPT in their studies. A transfer and disclosure of these tools helps maintain integrity in specific publication. So it's important for authors to disclose the context and extent of AI assistance in their research and journals. 
should be upfront about their AI usage in the review process. So identify the specific LLM that is large language model mentioned in the text. So let's see if he can guess. So you could see that ChatGPT has given the response that the specific language model LLM mentioned in the text is OpenAI's GPT. So, so this was about the prompt information synthesis and retrieval. Now moving to the next prompt. So our next prompt here is enhanced query response. So optimizing how models respond to queries involves crafting more intricate prompts that guide the AI to deliver precise and useful answers. So for this we'll write a prompt that would be provide an answer based on the context given. So be succinct and clear. If uncertain, respond with cannot confirm. So we'll write the prompt for this and I have written the prompt earlier. So I'll show you guys. This is the prompt and we'll ask ChatGPT about the enhanced query response. So we have pasted the prompt here and our prompt is provide an answer based on the context given. That is be succinct and clear. If uncertain, provide with cannot confirm. So our prompt is here, the innovative drug. Alzama was developed as a result of collaborative efforts between several biotech firms. So this drug aimed at treating autoimmune disorders represent a significant breakthrough in biomedicine. So we'll ask the chat GPT the question, what is the purpose of Alzumab? So let's see what it respond to us. So you could see that the chat GPT has responded, the purpose of Alzumab is to treat autoimmune disorders. So this is the type of prompt that is named as enhanced query response. So it optimizes how models respond to queries involve crafting more intricate prompts that guide the AI to deliver precise and useful answers. So now we'll move to the next type of prompt that is advanced text categorization. So to handle more complex tasks, combining detailed instructions with context and examples can significantly enhance the model's performance. So here we'll write the prompt to assess the sentiment of the following statements. So we'll write some statements and ask our chat GPT or AI model to assess them and classify them as negative, positive or neutral. So let's see. We will write a prompt here. Assess the sentiment. Of the following statement. As positive. Negative. Or neutral. And after this. We will write a statement. To chat GPT. So our statement would be the movie's stunning visuals or shadow its weak storyline. So let's see how ChatGPT classifies this statement as positive, negative or neutral. <clears throat> So you could see that the chat GPT has generated its response and it stated that the sentiment of this statement, the movie's stunning visuals or shadow its weak storyline is mixed. It acknowledges a positive aspect that is stunning visuals and a negative one, weak storyline. So you could see here that the chat GPT can be used for sentiment analysis. So you could provide statements and ask chat GPT whether it's positive, neutral or negative. Now moving to the next prompt. So our next prompt is dynamic conversations. So creating conversational systems that adapt to various tones and complexities is a fascinating application of prompt engineering. So here's how you might design a system to provide simplified friendly response. So for this, we'll write a prompt and let's see what your AI model and our chat GPT will give a response. So this is a conversation. So here we'll write a prompt and start a conversation with our AI model. So first we'll write, hi there, what's your role? So let's see what it responds. So as our AI model chat GPT, it states that hello, my role is to assist you by providing information, answering questions and helping with a wide range of tasks. How can I assist you today? So you can continue the conversation here and we'll continue and ask him whether 
you know about photosynthesis if yes kindly explain it to me so you could see that our chat gpt has started generating the response and it has stated that yes i can explain photosynthesis and it's a process used by plants algae and certain bacteria to convert light energy usually from the sun into chemical energy repeat <clears throat> usually from the sun into chemical energy and it is giving us some examples you could go through that and you can continue your conversation with your ai model so this is the another kind of prompt now we'll move to the next prompt type that is the innovative code generation so expanding on the potential of llms that is large language models in code generation let's explore a more intricate example that is we'll ask them to write a code for us so we'll write a prompt that would be write a python function that calculates the factorial of a number and prints the result so let's see what our chat gpt will respond to this So you could see that chat GPT is showing analyzing. So it's analyzing a statement. And after that, it will start generating the code for us. And you could see that it has generated the code and it has the prompts or the statements that explain the code itself. So if you want this code as understandable, you could ask the chat GPT to explain it line by line and you could see that the chat gpt has done the task for you so you could see that it has completed its response and it has explained each line of the code with all the necessity concepts. So moving now, so these enhanced prompts and examples showcase how versatile and powerful language models can be and within well-structured and throughout instructions. As we continue to explore and experiment with these prompts, the potential for creating sophisticated, nuanced and highly functional air driven applications become increasingly evident so these are the types of prompts you could try on and with that we have come to the end of this tutorial and congratulations you have just taken a big step towards mastering prompt engineering with practice and patience you will be crafting prompts that bring on the best in ai if you found this tutorial informative and helpful then give it a thumbs up thank you and keep learning with simply learn Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.